We just started with our ice cream cones. And now we are going to take some scoops of blueberry pie filling. And we're gonna go ahead and stick them in each of these ice cream cones. Don't want too much, just enough that it can fill that bottom layer there. Wanna make sure that we get all of these. This is gonna be such an amazing dessert for later. My family is going to love these because I don't know if it's just me, but we're all sweet tooths and we love our sweets. So I like to make as many desserts as possible and I like to try new things all the time. So we're going to fill that last one. And now we're gonna go ahead and move this off to the side. And now we're gonna go ahead and bring this into here. Get our little cupcake tin. And of course, it's a cupcake tin, so you know that we have to put our cupcake wrappers. Otherwise, it's useless, right? And we're just gonna start with six, because we don't need too many of these. We don't wanna waste anything. And we're gonna bring more of that blueberry pie filling. And we're gonna do the same thing here that we did with our ice cream cones. I'm just gonna put a little scoop in each of these. Just make sure we get all that in there. Just enough that we can coat that bottom. So we can have a nice good layer of blueberry pie filling which has actual blueberries in it, which is really good because I love blueberries. So we're just gonna make sure that we can spread that out there, make sure it co covers this entire bottom. So it's not super lumpy on one side and smooth on the other. We wanna make sure it's all smoothened out. There we go. And now for the fun part, we're gonna take some graham crackers and we're gonna crush them. Start with one sheet of graham crackers. And let's just crush it up. Get all those crumbs in there. It can be chunky, it can be perfect, whichever. They actually do sell graham cracker crumbs in stores, but What's the fun in that? So we're just gonna get all that in there. And yes, I did clean my hands before this, so no germs allowed in my house. Make sure we get all of them. No cupcake wrapper left behind. That looks Perfect, I am so excited to try this already, but we're not done yet. We need to bring in some homemade vanilla ice cream. And we've got our trusty ice cream scoop here. I'm just gonna get a nice big scoop of that. And we're gonna fill our ice cream cups here. Let's get our second scoop here. We want nice big scoops so we can fill this entire wrapper here. Make sure that you can't see the stuff we put in the bottom so it wants to make sure that it covers that entire part. There we go. Woo. Knocking off to the side of it. There we go. Now I don't mind getting my hands a little bit messy, but you can always use different ice cream scoopers or whatever is easier for you. All right, and now we're going to bring our ice cream cones back in here. We're gonna take each ice cream cone and we're gonna go ahead and just plop it on there, on our ice cream. Make sure that these are all good. And we wanna try and get as much of that ice cream into the cone as possible. 
There we go. Don't want to lose any of that blueberry pie filling. And here's the last one. Now we can, we can take our ice cream cones and we're going to stick these into the freezer for maybe like 20 minutes. Alright, looks like it's all done now. It's all frozen. So let's go ahead. I'm going to take this one here. We're just going to peel that off. Ooh, look how good that looks. Oh my gosh. That is more perfect than I expected. <laughs> All right, I think it's finally time to try this. Mmm. <laughs> oh my god. Mmm. That is so good. Mm.